Sporting an X-Men t-shirt and a fresh cut over his right eye, Michael Everett is escorted by police into the back of a squad car. A day before his 39th birthday, he's charged with aggravated assault after an early morning attack at the South Cross Square Apartments. I was shocked. Nothing like that happens here. Police say Everett spotted a 27-year-old woman walking up to this soda machine in the back of the complex. Reached around her neck with a rope and actually choked her. Uh, with the rope to the point of unconsciousness. Indications are that the suspect was continuing to choke her even after she was unconscious. Investigators say they have reason to believe the motive was sexual assault. But before that could happen, a neighbor who saw the attack from his window ran down and confronted Everett and chased him down. I mean, that was very brave of him. That was a good Samaritan right there. Saved her life. I mean, because anything could have happened in, in seconds. No telling what that guy could have done. Police say when the witness caught up to Everett about a block away from the complex, Everett decided to give up and agreed to walk back with him to the scene of the crime. But on their way, police say Everett pushed the Good Samaritan into the road and darted off in the opposite direction to those apartments over there. More witnesses at the scene pointed officers into a vacant apartment that, the, that they saw the suspect run into. Neighbors we spoke to say what the Good Samaritan did for that woman doesn't surprise them. We all work with one another. You know, if something goes on, we're there for each other. Just a safe community. And I'm glad they caught that guy. Hope he gets... Hope he gets what's coming to him. Police just ask anyone who may recognize Everett from other attacks to call them. There are some indications that, that there was some thought and some planning that went into it. That kind of leads us to believe that there may be other victims out there. Robert Price, Fox News at 9.